cancer diagnosis can be devastating, but many choose to fight their way through the disease with hope and positivity. Here's one Fresno man's story of his battle with prostate cancer, from his diagnosis through treatment and finally healing with a new outlook on life. This is 5,000 feet of Mehmet Noyan finds so much joy in his career. The commercial real estate developer has built many landmark locations around Fresno, including the Palm Bluffs and a new site off Highway 99 and Clinton Avenue. Uh, not traditional retail. It was September 2018 and routine blood work showed Mehmet had a high prostate specific antigen or PSA, which is a marker that can detect prostate cancer. Had no symptoms, had no uh, issues other than my, my blood work came back, it didn't look right did a biopsy, uh, got the call, uh, the call that nobody ever wants to get. It was confirmed Mehmet had prostate cancer and in aggressive form. He had to move fast and opted to have his prostate surgically removed. At the time of surgery, there were some adverse features that were found, including a lymph node being positive, which is why he needed radiation therapy to be formed. Dr. William Silvera is Mehmet's radiation oncologist and is also the medical director for the Department of Radiation Oncology at the Community Cancer Institute. Dr. Silvera explains Mehmet required radiation to his pelvic area to remove any traces of cancer. He also had hormone therapy on board, so that helps weaken any prostate cancer that might be present, and it also helps the radiation therapy work better. Mehmet said he was nervous at first. He was going to undergo radiation for seven to eight weeks, but he trusted Dr. Silvera and his team at the Community Cancer Institute. He was involved uh, in you know, the treatment plan. He explained to me what was going to happen. Uh, there was no surprises. He uh, you know, walked me through it. Uh, the procedure uh, was not a major invasive. I, I was expecting pain and after effects and, and they were minor. Mehmet says he remained positive about his prognosis and it helped to have an exceptional cancer center in his backyard. I've been through several facilities in Southern California and this uh, is so much better, nicer, you know, more state-of-the-art. Uh, I feel very blessed that we have this facility here that you don't have to leave Fresno. I think the hospital, the doctors, and all the staff here are dedicated to bringing state-of-the-art treatment to the Central Valley so that you don't have to go elsewhere, Bay Area, Southern California, and I know for a fact that we do deliver excellent care. Dr. Silvera says it's patients like Mehmet that prove a positive attitude can help in the fight against cancer. He is a very positive person. Throughout treatment, um, I can't think of someone who's had more inner fortitude. He worked the whole time. He worked out the whole time. It was impressive. Today, Mehmet is cancer-free, and his outlook on life is more clear now than ever. It's something that I won't forget, and I don't look back on it with, with bad memories. Um, you know, the whole cancer thing, um, cancer is a scary word, uh, but it, it, it changed my life. Uh, it, I think it made me a, a better person. Uh, it made me appreciate life more. I just want to thank all my doctors for everything they did for me. I wouldn't be here today if it weren't for them.